I'm Chris Penrose and I'm the executive director of Layup Youth Basketball and also one of the co-curators of the Future of Access Basketball group show that's happening at the Combine. So Layup has been doing programming in community of cost-free basketball and youth coach development for 10 years. And one of the things that we were seeing is that there are bigger obstacles that we're running up against. And one of those things is that the potential of basketball is that it can and should be the most accessible sport. Everyone says, it's just simple. All you need is a ball and a rim to play. And reality is that we're not seeing that. You need indoor courts and court time is hard to get. You need coaches that are trained and certified and you need equipment. So what we started to see is that we had to have a bigger conversation than our programs, which is about the future of access to basketball. So how do we as a broader community start to chip away at all of these barriers and let basketball achieve its potential? And that's what this show is inviting people to do is let's envision this, let's look at this and see what happens when we do make basketball accessible. My connection to Layup Basketball has started early on when Layup has started. I was brought on as someone who would document programming and just the energy of basketball within the, the organization and the community. So one of the works that I have in the show is titled Where We Play and that work is composed of different portraits of youth and the youth in that work are from Dixon Grove Middle School and it started off with workshops done at that school around photography and around basketball and it was the span of six workshops and so the images that are in that piece are of the youth in a gym and we wanted to really like ignite this gym with energy and portraits of the kids and have the viewer spend so much time with the work. As you're looking through it, you see different expressions of the kids holding and playing with basketballs. It was really created to emphasize the conversation about access to gyms that are dormant and bring life into them. What inspires me to shoot basketball is just like to show like raw emotion and with layup, a lot of the participants are fairly new to basketball and to see them come into the gym just looking very like nervous and like shy and then the second that happiness starts to show in their faces when they get the game or learn a new skill to so just turn into excitement. I just love capturing that whole story of them just starting something new and pushing themselves to starting something new and just have fun with it. A lot of my photos up in the gallery shows community. There's some images that you'll see where there'll be a player maybe going up for a shot or just dribbling and you'll see all these kids behind them just cheering them on and just loving it. The current reality we're facing today is that Jumpstart reports basketball to be the most expensive sport for registration in Canada, which surprises a lot of people that it's more expensive than hockey. So I think one of our biggest things is awareness and I think continuing this conversation and that's why we pull together galleries like this because we're bringing together a group of people from a culture that's broader than just being on the court. And sometimes we get so close up to what on-court development and skill looks like that we forget that there's such a big conversation around design, around photography and around art and it's pulling in these different emotions from those different spaces. And so our hope is really to just continue to help people understand the importance of access to basketball at the youth level and that basketball can change lives. And I think that the vision really is that every kid in every neighborhood in the city, in this province, in this country who's interested in basketball would be able to have an accessible team experience in their community. Right now it is far from that, but I think that with a collective approach on this, we can get there. If you care about basketball and you care about youth having access, you are a part of the future of access to basketball. If you want to get connected with Layup, find us at layup.ca or on socials with Layup Youth Basketball, LinkedIn, Instagram, we're all there and tap in with us on the future of basketball.